what's up everybody welcome back to another video from exotic astrology and today we will start with a new playlist new series and i will name it as the art of mind control okay because we will discuss in this how to control the mind <laughs> interestingly the best warrior in the battlefield of kurukshetra well, if you do not know what Kurukshetra is, then maybe you are not from India or you are not from the Vedic tradition. Let me just give you an introduction. It is a part of the Indian epic named as the Mahabharata, where there is a war of the good and the bad. And in this war, ultimately, Lord Krishna who is on the side of the Pandavas. Along with the Pandavas, they become victorious. And the enemies, who are the Kurus or the Kauravas, they perish. About the Kurukshetra war and Mahabharat, I will discuss specifically in the playlist of Mahabharat. But here, I want to speak about mind control. Why I am speaking of Kurukshetra here is because in Kurukshetra, Lord Krishna is asked different questions by Arjuna. And Arjuna is an unparalleled warrior. There is nobody parallel or equal to him in the battlefield of Kurukshetra. He is the best, at least in his generation. May not be in the generation of Bhishma and Drona, but at least in his generation, there is no ambiguity of his superiority over everybody else. But this person is telling to Lord Krishna that I can control the winds. But I cannot control the mind. Now, United States of America, when recent hurricanes have been going on, what have they done? They can't do anything except saying that evacuate. That's all they can do. Because that is the only thing which can perhaps protect them or reduce the damage. But unfortunately, they can't do anything to save the people apart from evacuating. They cannot change the course of the wind, winds or the hurricane or the cyclone. But here Arjuna is telling, I can control the winds. I can do it effortlessly. One weapon he discharges and that's it. But now the same Arjuna is telling, I cannot control the mind. Mind is more difficult to control than the winds. So Arjuna is telling, I can control the wind, but I cannot control the mind. Which means how difficult the mind is to be controlled, right? And that means that we need a higher level of intelligence, a higher level of order to control the mind. There are unlimited ways of controlling the mind. But here I will start with one of the techniques because this is an introductory video on the mind control. So Lord Krishna answers to Arjuna by saying Abhyasena. Abhyas means practice and Vairagya, detachment. So Lord Krishna says to Arjuna that by these two things you can control the mind. What is the first thing? Practice and the second is detachment. Abhyas Vairagya. When you practice slowly to bring the mind back and focus it in one place when it wavers around here there and when you detach yourself from the activities which distract the mind Detachment is external, control is internal. That has to be simultaneous. For example, if a person eats too much sugar, sounds familiar, <laughs> then how should he control his mind? Well, the first thing he should do is practice. Whenever he thinks of sugar, 
or eating something a pastry or a cake or some sugar candy or some sweet he should retract the mind back he should say no don't think about it and secondly is detachment he should reduce eating sugar then what he is eating he should reduce the quantity he is getting detached from sugar slowly because if that is not happening and you are only thinking of not eating sugar and you are eating all the time then that's not going to help am i being being understood here detachment and practice similarly if somebody wants to give up some bad habit like alcohol first of all he has to make a determination inside that i will not do this and secondly he should give up the company of those friends who force him to do this or by staying in whose company you also feel like doing it that means you are gaining detachment which means that if you practice and detach yourself then slowly 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 the mind comes in control it is not a easy process it's a very difficult process but it is still possible two techniques practice and detachment practice and detachment practice and detachment so i will end the video here and if you have any questions queries and comments then please let me know or else until next time bye bye see you